Uh, good morning, Jen and Brittany. It's a day all about this planet and the physical world that we live in. From the dirt we walk on to the sky above us, today's main focus is on keeping our planet healthy. With climate change, species extinction, pollution, there's a lot that needs to be done to make sure we're living on a sustainable planet years from now. And today is one day of the year to do it. In the spring, I always like to remind people to, to start watering kind of deep and infrequently, especially during when we get to our hot summer months. Katie Kosenke with Spokane's Urban Forestry Department says it starts with just taking care of what's in our backyard. We see a lot of drought stre stressed trees, and those trees can be more susceptible to insect and disease problems because they are stressed. So you can keep them healthy by being sure that they you know, have adequate water and they're not drought stressed. It's the simple things like watering your trees and plants that make a difference. The environment, plants and trees around us are supposed to help us. Trees reduce pollution. They filter the air we breathe by um, putting out oxygen and absorbing and storing carbon dioxide and other harmful pollutants. They also help us to mitigate our stormwater runoff. That's such an important thing about trees. And the better we treat them, the better they'll treat us. And that's what today is about, recognizing the role we play in keeping our planet healthy. So what's step one? Well, there are several ways you can get involved. There's recycling, making sure you're not littering, plant a tree, it's the perfect season for it. And even today, if you can, ride your bike to work. It may seem small, but if we all take intentional steps, we'll start seeing progress. The biggest goal, carrying those actions outside of just today. Make it a habit of incorporating these steps into your daily routine, and it can be fun. Just a couple of days ago, some of the CRIM team were out collecting trash along the Spokane River. Our reporter Tim Pham shared the work they did. After the city shared this photo of trash along the bank, they decided to get out and clean up what they could. It's quick projects like like these that are fun but still beneficial. In celebration of the day, all state parks have free admission, so there's another reason for you to get out and enjoy the earth as you keep in mind how you can do good for it. In the newsroom, Shana Walltower. I'll send things back in studio.